in today's video i'm going to show you how to change the sample rate of a melody so it sounds like it's from the 1980s the 1960s the 1940s the lo-fi effect on uh, melodies so i have a melody right here okay so i'm going to uh, put the melody right on my track right and what you have to do is we need a, a web type of file to do this to change the sample rate um if you do not want to use this method you can actually use a uh, vinyl just quickly show you how to load up vinyl so this is a free plugin from uh, iso isotope so what you can do is create that lo-fi effect select the year and let's 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 play let's play You can get the same effect from using uh, vinyl so, so for this tutorial we're not going to be using vinyl we're going to be using the direct method that you can use in FL studio so we come here select the track render as audio clip make sure it's 24 24 uh, beat with archive remainder start drag your sample on the playlist it's quite low let's do that double click edit in audio editor now what you have to do here is go to this tab edit settings now that it's loaded uh, you can actually change the figures from here from like 2000 to at least you know 4100 96,000 is like top quality but we're looking for a low lower sample rate to get that lo-fi effect so let me try 3000 Okay, good so now what you need to do is click on the resample size click on the temple sign accept drag this to the bottom right there double click normalize and let's hear what we have So now we have that effect so to get the the dusty uh, radio effect you need to send it to the track open parametric eq all right click on the presets and go down to radio effects yeah radio effects
Okay, sounds pretty dif different from the original sample. So that's how you change the sample rate of a melody in FL Studio and make it sound lo-fi. So yeah guys, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up, hit that subscription button, hit the notification bell uh, button to get notified and yeah guys, if you have any questions, comment down below and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.